To make the most of your self-development efforts, it is crucial that you set a direction by identifying your personal and professional goals and decide where you should go. Doing so will help you avoid wasting time and energy while keeping you on track to a desired outcome. Sometimes an individual doesn't know where they want to go, what they want to do. They're afraid to take that next step. They don't know what to expect. It's easier to do nothing than to take that next step to see what you can accomplish. When planning self-development, there are several different things that one can take into consideration. Uh, for many, it is they, they look at their weaknesses and they try to improve. Another method, however, is to look at the strengths and try to maximize on those strengths. So if someone is good in, in public speaking, what they'll do is they'll make themselves even better at public speaking and, and that will help them throughout their career. I think things to think about when you are planning your self-development is to not think solely in the moment. Think about what's going to make you a diversified leader. What's going to bring your unit or the, the Army in the long run as a whole forward? And what's going to help the Army as a whole? One of the b best techniques I was taught was at the Commander L Staff College is uh, to back away from yourself for a second and say, where do you want to be in 20 years, in 15 years, in 10 years, and then in five years? So you start at the, at the uh, 20 year mark and say, this is where I'd like to be. And then they say, what are the steps to get you there? What do you have to do developmental-wise at the 10-year mark or the five-year mark to be moving in that direction uh, to get you to that objective? Uh, so uh, that's the advice I give uh, to many soldiers, uh, whether they're gonna stay in the Army for 20 years, 30 years, or get out in 10 years or five years or tomorrow, is where do you wanna be in 20 years from now? Then what are the, the if that's where you wanna be, what are the things you must do to get there? A college degree, a master's degree, additional education, accreditation. What tools do you need to put in your toolbox to put you in a position where that's where you'll end up? Your self-development direction is a personal choice and should be made based on the experiences and goals you would like to achieve in your military career as well as your interests, needs, and resources. Setting milestones both for the near and long term can help to keep you on track with the direction you have chosen.